Hey guys, uh, sorry about uh, this late video. I promised a lot of people I was going to get this done, so I'm going to get it done. Um, I'm j I think I'm in the beginning of a cold, so please excuse this right here. I was really inspired by Hank Green's video, uh, 10 book reviews in 4 minutes. And I decided I wanted to do some book reviews throughout the year. And it's very interesting to put a book review together because there's so many elements that I have to keep in mind when reading a book. So I decided to give this a go for a year. This is going to be my goal, is to do a video at least once a month for a year. That's 12 books. 12 books! Do you know, uh, do you know how hard that is to do? Before we start reviewing books, I decided to do guidelines. Because every reviewer needs guidelines to show why they're not going to review certain books. I actually came up with a list, mainly because there are certain books I just dread reading, and there are certain books that, even though I really like them, I'm not going to review for certain reasons. I'm not going to review books that are made or being made into a movie and or TV show. Because a lot of people are into the books that are being made into movies or TV shows. I'm doing this mainly because, one, I'm going to be biased against a lot of the books that are in this category. And... I also don't want to offend anyone in the fandom. I'm going to review books of many genres, although many books will be fictional. I want to review a lot of different books and a lot of different genres in in the world of books. I just need help figuring out what books to read. Age limit will be young adults and up, preferably college level. Basically, if you go into a Barnes & Noble or you go into a Books A Million and you see a book in the young adult section, I will probably read those if you ask me very, 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 very nicely. I cannot emotionally be invested in a 10-year-old child, in like, as a character. I will mostly do books 600 pages and less, depending on subject and interest in said subject. I really don't want to read a gigantic book and say that I'm going to read this in a month. It's to save me time, it's to save you time, because let's face it, if it wasn't Harry Potter you probably wouldn't read a book over 600 pages. But again, there are exceptions, but I'm sticking to this rule very, very strictly. <laughs> My last guideline is books, books will be reviewed based off of content, character development, originality and plot, my actual interest in the book, and if, and this this is going to be, you know, this might and might not be in all of the book re reviews, but I wanted to add it, if the book could be turned into a movie or show, if it would actually be good and if people would watch it. There's a lot of movies being, there's a lot of movies being made that are based off of books. There's a lot of TV shows that are being based off of books. And, you know, me seeing this trend, I decided, you know what, if a book can be made into a movie, would it be good? Without further ado, this is the first book that I'm going to review for my very first book review, and it is Reincarnation. It's actually really good, kind of, but you'll you'll hear more about it and my problems with it um later on in the next video so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this series of book reviews and i hope you read along with me happy reading